Hello friend, I am Samadhi back with a new tutorial video regarding soil mechanics. In my last video, I discussed about hydrogen bond. This video, I gonna show you interparticle force in a soil mass. From this video, you learn about what you mean by interparticle force as well as what type of interparticle force act in the soil mass. Watch the video till the end. Brush up your concept, enrich your knowledge. If you are new in my channel, subscribe the channel, press the bell icon for never miss an update because I am coming with this type of video. Before understanding interparticle force, we have to understand what do you mean by force. As per Newton's first law, every object will remain at the rest or in uniform motion in a straight line unless to change its state by the action of external force. So as simple as much, force is something that change the velocity or you can say that change the state of matter. So you can say easily, force is something if you apply to the static body, then static body is convert to the dynamic body and vice versa. If you apply the force against the dynamic body, it's convert to the static body. So the concept is very clear. Force is a thing which can change the state of the body. So what do you mean by interparticle force? Then we come to interparticle force in the soil mass. Interparticle force is a kind of attraction force, first of all. Secondly, interparticle force of attraction, you can define the attraction force between two particles yeah it can be atoms to atoms it can be atoms to molecule it can be molecule to molecule let's see how the interparticle force in the soil mass is acting the soil mass is very small particle and they are very close due to interparticle force acting these two particles are gradually come to close and what and if we know how this distance between two soil particles are getting close the answer will be the self weight of the soil number two capillary force number three seepage force and lots of other things so what kind of interparticle force in acting in a soil mass or the, how many types of interparticle force acting on a soil mass so basically there is two types of interparticle force that acting in a soil mass number one gravitational force and number two is a surface force so let's talk about what is gravitational force the gravitational force is a force that attracts any two subjects that have a particular mass we call the gravitational force is attractive that is known as the newton's universal law of gravitation so if you want to the formula that is f equal to g mm by r square where f is the force of gravity g is the gravitational constant value is 6.67 into 10 to the power minus 11 capital m that should be the mass of one object small m that is the mass of another subject and r is the distance between two objects so you can say if you want to relate to the gravitational force in soil mechanics then you can say capital m is the mass of the one particle and small m is the mass of the another particle and that is r that r is the distance between two particles in this way, gravitational force is generated between two particles which is known as an interparticle force in soil mechanics. And if you see consciously that the gravitational force proportional to the mass but inversely proportional to the distance between two mass. So just imagine if the distance of two molecules is gradually close, gradually close, the value of force is increasing so much where this gravitational force is acting basically gravitational force that is very much important for coarse green soil that means gravel sand because coarse green soil we know that that is the 80 mm to 4.75 mm particle range after that clay and seal which is known as a fine grain for fine grain soil we have to understand surface force so next video we gonna talk about surface force so this is all about this video I discuss about what is force, what do you mean by interparticle force and how the interparticle force acting on a soil mass and there is how many types of soil interparticle force and then I talk about gravitational force and where the gravitational force is acting. So yeah, if there is doubt, do comment in the comment section. Still, if you are watching my video, subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for never miss an update.
because I am coming with this types of video almost every day. Thank you for watching this video. More knowledge, more opportunity.